Good. Are we recording? Yep. Yep. <coughs> Welcome to an unboxing of Pack of Heroes from Adventureland Games. So uh, here we have the game box, Pack of Heroes, and today we are unboxing on top of this delightful Pack of Heroes playmat, which you can order from packofheroes.com, um, which just makes playing the game a bit more fun and exciting to play on a playmat. But anyway, here is the game itself. Uh, there's the awesome cover, of course, done by the game's artist, John DC. Excellent. And here's the back of the box, where you can see everything that comes in the game. And you might note how much stuff comes in this tiny little box. Let's crack it open and see it right now. Okay. So, shrink wrap, off. Oh, there we go. Okay, the shrink wrap is off, everybody. Okay. Let's open up the box and see what we've got inside. Okay. What is this? A mini comic greets us when we open up. Yes, that's right. 12 page mini comic explaining the whole background to the game, the story, the origin of the battle for Power City. So, uh,. Written and illustrated by John DC. An awesome little cool mini comic featuring all the characters from the game. We just put it in because we love you that much. There it is. The Battle for Power City mini comic. Okay. Next up, I might actually show you the rule book first. The, the next booklet here, Rules of Play. This teaches you how to play the game. Again, full color illustrations. We've got all the components. We've got Meet the Teams. We've got a hero card overview, and then how to play, and of course there's diagrams, full instructions. There you go. Rules of play. How to play Pack of Heroes. Okay. And the third booklet that comes in the game is the chunkiest of all. It is the Pack of Heroes Superhero Almanac. Uh, this has all the extra little rules and descriptions for each character in the game, organized by team. So this is mainly just clarifying uh, some of the more complicated powers, but also it's just an at-a-glance guide to each team. So you can see how each team plays, what they do, and it's also just fun to flip through. Uh, and also makes you feel like an FBI agent looking through a secret dossier about superheroes. So that's pretty cool. So eight different teams, all fully described, and then at the back there's uh, descriptions for the weapon cards and exactly how they work. So generally when you're playing a game, you don't really need the rules of play and you might just occasionally refer to the superhero almanac um, if you're not sure about how certain powers work. So that's why we split it into two. And there it is, the superhero almanac. Okay, here we have the actual game inside. I might show you the wooden components first. So they come bagged in a little baggie like this. And these are the wound markers for the game and the stun markers. So you place these on cards to represent wounds and these chunky purple uh, octagonal cylinders are the big stun markers to show when a hero is stunned. So yeah, so these wooden bits are made in Germany at the same factory that makes uh, all the classic uh, wooden components you're used to in German style games. So they're great quality, nice glossy paint, Really cool. So there you go. And now, let's get into the game itself, which is the cards. So I'll just open this up. Okay. Oh, I should also note while we're here, the wonderful custom designed insert that keeps everything nice and snug. And you even get one extra baggie. So, you know, if you want to put the wound markers in, your, in their own baggie, you can do that. If you want to put your favorite team in its own baggie so it doesn't get wet, you can do that. Or you can just get a free baggie out of the game. So, anyway, back to the cards. So here are the cards, 80 in all. And they come shrink wrapped, so we'll just open this up. Pull that off. Okay. So first up... Oh, look at them all. So first up, we have two summary cards. Now these cards are just uh, summaries that you can use during play. They remind you of the rules. So there's a rules reference on this side, and on this side, all the different power icons and how they work. So that's just a really handy feature. Then we get to the meat of the game, the actual hero cards. So I'll just kind of give you a 
quick look at those. Pretty great, awesome colors, awesome art, which we'll see more of in a sec. So they are all the hero cards. Then there's also weapon cards. Okay, they're all the weapons. And then these are the power cards. So these are the cards you play with which trigger all the different powers on the different heroes you'll have. So each player will get nine of these and uses them uh, to trigger their different heroes. Pretty cool. And the art on these is just awesome. It's like a comic book page. Yeah, really great. Okay. So we'll put those there. Um, now let's have a look at some of the hero cards a bit more closely. So each team, there are eight teams in the game. Each team comes with a team card, which shows you the logo of the team. And on the back, uh, something about the team. So for example, Liberty Legends, you get their team cheer on the back. Um, so as you can see, these are kind of designed to look like uh, vintage trading cards. So if you're a child of the 80s, you might recognize some of the way these are laid out, which is pretty great. So let's take a look at Liberty Legends. So there's their team card. And then here we have Liberty Steel, who's the leader. And on the back, you get his origin story, you get some different stats about him, you get his catchphrase, which is pretty cool. Uh, there's Doc Feelgood, one of our favorite characters. Uh, Judge Justice. So, yep. Yeah. Objection overruled. Now that is a catchphrase. Uh, Rocky Roadhouse. Pretty great. And Bazooka Girl. Yeah, one of the most powerful powers in the game, Bazooka Girl. So there you go. And I'll just quickly show you some of the other uh, cards. Admiral Rhino, he's awesome. Oh yeah, Safari Squad. Very attractive team. There's Flamingo. Guild of Ghouls. Also one of my favorites. Ah, oh, little voodoo. She is fun to play. Zombie Lad. We have Data Brigade, the robots. Pretty great. Disco Droid. Trashatron. Knights of the Five Realms. These are like uh, your fantasy stereotype kind of heroes. So Smash a Lot, as featured on the cover. Freak Show Five. Elementines, Muddy, Zonus, so many great characters. Galactonauts, who are kind of an alien family. Pretty great team. Ah, oh, look at this mountain of stuff. This is what you get inside Pack of Heroes. Thanks for watching our unboxing. We'll see you later. Is that okay? Was I vaguely in shot? <laughs> awesome. I mean, I can I can crop it and no, stuff you a little were bit. Perfectly in shot. <laughs> I just couldn't figure out how to turn it off.